Excuse me. Oh, hey, it's you. Yeah. Okay, I'm not sure what kind of vibe I was given off before, but I am not interested in your schnitzel. No, 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 no. God, no. I, I, I just have one quick question. Victoria seems like a great girl. Why wouldn't you want to marry her? Ach, okay. Victoria ist wunderbar. I'm sorry. Wunderbar is a German word for wonderful. Yeah, no, I, I know. Oh, you speak German. Sie sprechen Deutsch. Ich habe keine Freunde. Die Deutsche sprechen in Amerika. Und es macht mich so einsam. No, 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 no. Just, just, just the one word. Oh. oh. Ah. Okay. Victoria. There is a word in German. Lebenslanger Schicksalschatz. And the closest translation would be lifelong treasure of destiny. And Victoria is wunderbar. But she is not my Lebenslanger Schicksalschatz. She is my Beinahe Leidenschaft Gegenstand. You know? You know wunderbar, but you don't know Beinahe Leidenschaft Gegenstand? <laughs> That's something we learn in kindergarten. I'm sorry, kindergarten is a German word for... No, life. no, I, I know that one. Oh, okay. But you don't know Beinahe Leidenschaft Gegenstand. You are maddeningly inconsistent. <laughs> it means the thing that is almost the thing that you want. But it's not quite. Das ist Victoria to me. How do you know she's not Lebenslager Schicksalschatz? I mean, maybe as the years go by, she'll get Lebenslager Schicksalschatz here. No, 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 no. <laughs> Lebenslager Schicksalschatz is not something that develops over time. It is something that happens instantaneously. It courses through you like the water of a river after a storm. Filling you and emptying you all at once. You feel it throughout your body. In your hands. In your heart. In your stomach. In your skin. Of course, you feel it in your Schlagmachende, Jungen. Pardon my French. <laughs> Have you ever felt this way about someone? I think so. If you have to think about it, you have not felt it. And you're absolutely sure you'll find that someday? Of course. Everyone does eventually. You just never know when or where. And he was right. Unfortunately, the when of it was still a little ways down the road. But the where of it? Cindy's ex-roommate, right? Yeah, and you are the professor. I took one of your classes. Really? Which mm -hmm. one? Econ 305. Econ 305? I don't teach. Oh, no. Yeah. Excuse me, I'm going to jump onto the tracks now. No, 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 don't. You were great. You were great. <laughs> Wait a second. This is my umbrella. I left this umbrella at Cindy's. You totally stole my umbrella. What? No, I didn't. This is my umbrella. I bought this. Excuse me. It even has my initials on it right here. TM. Ted Mosby. Yeah. Look again. Ted Mosby. Those are my initials. TM. 
Tracy McConnell. Um, no, Tracy McConnell. It's TM, totally my umbrella. Uh, you're TM, terribly mistaken, because this umbrella has always belonged, TM, to me. <laughs> Although, I did lose it for a few years there. Um, so I went to this dance club. On St. Patrick's Day. On St. Patrick's Day. And you left it there. And I left it there. And you never thought you'd see it again. And I never thought I'd see it again. Funny how sometimes you just find things. And that, kids, is how I met your mother.